we went through the admissions process before COVID. And my son was able to tour the school and spend a day with the student before COVID. So he had expectations. As a family, we had expectations of what we thought a day in the life of New Life Academy was going to be. The most, I guess, positive thing that I took from the entire COVID situation is I didn't see anything different other than having some masks and some social distancing with what those expectations were before and what he actually experienced when he came here. Mm. You know, even, even with you know, all the health concerns and everything going on, there was never a time ever where we felt that precautions weren't being taken, that we felt unsafe sending Tony here. The organization was impeccable. We know exactly what to expect. We know exactly where to go, what to do, what to send him with. Uh, it, we were blown away. Uh, we, we felt just completely safe and comfortable sending him to in-person learning every single day without question. I think to the connection, the kid connection, we have one that's virtual learning. She doesn't see anyone except for here on a screen. And Noah's experiencing that in-person connection with his friends where he's been able to, you know, make those friend groups and it's a no-brainer. Well, and the continuity too, right? So things are gonna come up, things are gonna change. They're gonna be exposed to different things, but knowing that they can be outside of the classroom, have a solid understanding when they're gonna return, what they can do in the meantime, still having that connection from a distance perspective, I think was important because they didn't see it then as, oh, I'm missing school or I'm missing this event. Um, they still had that opportunity to attend, keep up with their studies if they weren't able to be in school in person. And Noah was quarantined twice. Like he hated missing school. He's like, I want to get back in school. I don't want to stay here. Which is completely opposite come, of no, anything no, you would have ever That would have never ever happened. Come out of it right. Noah. Mm -mm. He would have been like, oh, can I stay home today? Yes. How, yes. About, how about I quarantine again today and yeah. I'll stay home and play video games? But now he's like, oh, I want to yeah, go Yeah, he does not want to miss school. I love the fact that they ask that even when they're quarantined and when they're doing the uh, the, uh, the distance portion, that they are still like dress and shower and get ready as if you're actually going to school. I love that part of it. Mm -hmm. What the community requires of them, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs>